Hello everyone, my name is Arden, and welcome back to another video. Today, I'll be taking a look at probably my second favorite Marvel set of this year, the Marvel Studios Infinity Saga Bro Thor's New Asgard. So this is set 76200, it has 265 pieces, it's for ages 7 and up, and has two minifigures and another character, so three characters all together. Uh, there's Meek, Korg, and Bro Thor, and as the sign and a little build for Thor's house. So now I'll take a look at the build. So here is Bro Thor's new Asgard, even though it's not new Asgard, but it's just the house. I don't know why it's not called Bro Thor's house. It's kind of weird. Uh, so the first thing I want to take a look at is this nice new Asgard sign that just says, Welcome to New Asgard, please drive slowly, and then it actually has the actual town there in of Tonesburg, Norway, there uh, on this. Uh, I think that this is just to uh, represent grass there with the lighter, darker green. It's lighter, darker. That doesn't make much sense. But uh, there's a few poles coming up in the ground that connect to this one by, or two by three tile, sorry, with a sticker there, which you want to apply nicely to have it straight onto the sign. So there's a few stickers throughout this set. Uh, you can see the main build is just like their living quarters. Uh, there's the TV, the uh, actual their sofa, a bunch of pizza boxes. It's quite a mess in here, but I really, really like that mess. Uh, there's a bunch of different accessories throughout it, like this pitchfork. There's a uh, uh, shovel there, a few cups, quite a bit of um, alcohol. Uh, beer bottles, a lot of those, a lot of pizza too, like a lot of pizza and a lot of beer bottles and there's the beer keg there and a chest and a fish, which is odd. Uh, they have a fireplace back there with like an air conditioning system. There's this really nice sticker piece right there which shows Thor, Valkyrie, and Korg and Meek from Ragnarok. Uh, you can see the three characters uh, sitting on their uh, sangrene couch. Uh, shelf up here, there are some books, another beer bottle, a little statue, and uh, another cup. There's a frying pan and a whip there, and you can see all the pizza boxes there, which have the same design, which I'll just take this one out and show you. Uh, there is Stormbreaker's Pizza, which is quite cool. The name of Thor's axe right there that was made in Infinity War. The design, the sticker, there's uh, three of these stickers throughout the set. And they're really, really nice stickers that really look quite good. There's just a pizza version of Stormbreaker there. And the other sticker uh, newspaper piece that there is is this, the New Asgard Times, five years after the blip, which is a very nice uh, sticker. I quite like it, and it just goes back there. You can put it straight, or you can just uh, have it off a little bit, which looks nice. They also have a little table there with a game controller, and Korg is also holding a game controller. There, there's their TV, which we'll just zoom in to show you the sticker, which is like a Lego version of, like, Lego games and a mix of Fortnite, uh, different things, not making an exact design of Fortnite like from the movie, but it's pretty similar and it's a nice uh, sticker piece and the TV build is also quite nice, like I guess a PlayStation down there, or some sort of game system. Uh, here is the exterior, which is because of all the different pieces like these, it looks a little weird. There are the bricks throughout it, and I don't think the exterior looks too bad, but you're really never going to be looking at this exterior unless you just start building onto it. You can see the door that has a bit of detailing there for some rocks and some different plants that you can or open up this stud, and you can see your minifigures through there and a bit of the build throughout it as well. There's the window here that can open up and close, depending how you would like it. The build is really, really nice. It's a small build that I know I'm gonna have on my desk just on the side of it, because it's a small build, but it's a really nice one featuring some of my favorite MCU characters. So now, I'll take a look at those characters right now. 
So here are the minifigures of the set. There's Bro Thor, Meek, and Cork. So here is Bro Thor. He's shirtless in his pajamas there. You can see his stomach overlapping his pajamas there, which is a nice uh, printing detail. It's just, uh, it's not the exact color uh, from the torso piece to here, which is something you would really see printing on darker pieces or even lighter pieces. It's really never right on uh, what the actual color is, but it's still a nice detail. There's some detailing throughout the pants. He has a pizza piece there, some dark or light bluish gray gloves, and there is the face print, the safe face print used in the two other appearances of Thor in this wave, and the same hairpiece, which is a nice hairpiece. There's the uh, lightning there in his eyes. Uh, I don't know if the smiling is the best expression, but I guess making a new expression for this one set doesn't make too much sense, but I would have liked to have a different expression because the smiling really doesn't fit the this, this scene with Korg being, or sorry, Thor being quite depressed in it. Um, here is Meek, uh, which looks quite nice in the purple color. There's these flower pieces that make more texture that looks like some legs instead of just the purple studs. Uh, the head, it's a printed headpiece, which looks nice. I like it. I I don't know what else they could have done, so I think it's good for uh, Meek. I don't know if we'll ever see Meek again, but for the set, I quite like this Meek. Here is my favorite mini or minifigure of the set one of my favorite MCU characters, and that's Korg. So he has these dual-molded arms, which I'm really happy they included, with the dark blue there, and the tan shirt, which has some leaves throughout it. No printing on the legs. I would have liked dual-molded legs with a bit of printing on the toes, just to create like a shorts design, but I guess that's a bit much for, that would be like a minifigure series quality figure in a $40 set probably not something you'll see. Uh, there's some back printing there, and he has a uh, controller and some headphones there in a darker tan color. He has a smiling face there with this rock piece and another smiling expression, which is a, I really like this figure, one of my favorites, and I'm really happy they included Korg in a set. I do like this, I would like to see him in uh, next year's uh, Thor Love and Thunder set, but for now, this is a really great minifigure. So now I'll go to my final thoughts on this set. So overall, I think this is an, an amazing set with really good characters and nice new minifigures being two new characters, Korg and Meek. And just the build is a really small but nice build. And I think this is an amazing $40 set. And I'd for, sur for sure suggest it. This is probably my second favorite Marvel set of the year first being that Guardian ship, but overall this is just a really, really great set, and I really, really like it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.